Add and edit text. In many places in Moodle where you can type in text, you'll use an editor. If your screen is smaller, you can expand the toolbar from the three dots. Many of the icons you'll know from word processing or other online software, but some may be unfamiliar. The multimedia icon here offers many options for adding sound and video, along with thumbnail images and subtitles. We explore adding media in a later video. These icons allow you to directly record sound and video from within the editor. H5P is free software for creating interactive content such as quizzes and the H5P icon allows you to either link to or upload an existing H5P file. The link icon allows you to link text to an external website. So for example, if we select the text United Nations and then click the link, a pop-up appears allowing us to paste in a URL or web address. Note we can also browse the repositories here and link to an uploaded file. The text will change colour, but note that the link will only work once you've saved the changes. Tiny MCE Editor allows you to drag and drop images directly onto the text box. And it automatically saves what you type, so if you have to leave it for a while or you accidentally go onto a different page or lose your connection, you don't have to start again. Other options are available from menus by clicking the words, for example from Edit, Find and Replace, from Tools, Code View, Word Count and an Accessibility Checker. This helps ensure your text is designed well to make it accessible for everyone on all devices and including people with restricted sight who use screen readers. You can also make useful tables and discover keyboard shortcuts from the help menu. If your admin has enabled AI tools on the site, you'll see a sparkles icon in the editor allowing you to generate text or an image from AI.